What up guys, Jet Shells here and welcome back to World of Tanks. First of all, I hope all of you guys out there had an awesome Christmas spending it with family and friends and sharing stories and catching up with the people that you care about. And I also hope that you guys will have a great New Year's wherever you are going to spend it. Uh, today's video I'm going to be featuring some T-37 and M24 Chaffee gameplay. Now the M24 Chaffee I have shown a video or two of it before, but I don't believe I've shown any T-37 gameplay on the channel yet. And it's something I'm going to be trying to do more of in the future. Uh, I tend to play a lot of the same scout tanks that I enjoy playing, but uh, for your guys' sake I'm going to try and diversify my gameplay more and play scouts that are either less popular or are considered um, not as good. Um, so you guys get a more uh, objective view of the wide variety of scout tanks that are in World of Tanks. I also want to welcome all of the new subscribers and viewers that recently came to my channel from Oz Irish. Um, and I want to personally thank uh, Oz Irish for recommending my channel in one of his uh, latest YouTube videos. It is very, very, very much appreciated, sir. Thank you very much for considering that my content is good enough for you to recommend. And for all you subscribers and viewers out there, if you guys have any questions about any of the scouts, their strengths, their weaknesses, um, play styles with particular scouts, or scouting in general, techniques, um, I don't know everything. I'm always in a process of learning new things myself, but I'll do the best that I can to answer any questions that you guys might have about any particular scout tank. And also, if there's any particular content that you guys would like to see on the channel, um, a particular scout uh, gameplay or certain map uh, scouting guides or anything like that, just let me know in any of the comments of these videos and I'll do my best to answer any questions that you guys have. So, hope you guys enjoy this video. Take care and happy hunting. Alright, we got Redshire. Uh, tier 7 game. 3 Arty and 3 Scouts. So that's a lot of the teams that aren't really frontline brawly type tanks. Which means that'll be a lot of speed and this battle will be really fast paced. And since I'm a little bit of a lower tier, I'm gonna go instead of scouting the four line, which is what I normally do if I'm higher tier, I'm gonna go over here to the nine line to this uh, stereotypical spotting bush in uh, F9. Should have a safe approach to this bush. Sometimes you get lit um, driving into this bush up here on this ridge. From my left, from enemy scouts that go into their bushes, but at this tier I think I should be okay with this um, sharper angle approach. And I know that'll get me lit. We'll stay in cover in this rock. Our Lukes is going pretty ham there. He's going to die. But let's pay attention and see what he spots on the minimap there. Bishop and Panther. I spotted the OI. I think I'm going to run here. My team's moved up. Oh, and look at that, E25. My team have moved up into that corridor, so they don't really need anybody spotting for them anymore. So I'm going to relocate back over here to the 4 line. Let's see if I can help get some vision on the 4-5 line here, or get some crossfire going into the 8 line. I don't know why, we might need premium for that. Enemy armor is 
and we lost the castle, looks like, which isn't a huge deal, um, because when they start driving out of there, it's really easy to shoot them. Uh, I'm not quite high enough to shoot over this rock, but you can shoot into the window from this position. Got a one-shot firefly there, keep that in mind. Uh, that was a bad shot. Okay, need to drop off so I don't get shot. And this tiger's gonna go ham, I think, so let's get ready to run. Oh, got shot by the panther. I need to I need to get off that ridge. Stay away from the panther. And let's just pull some range from this engagement. Chaffee's shooting at me too. I think our T-43 should be able to handle that Tiger, yep. So now I'm just going to play Sniper Support for the T-43, um, for now. We need to clean up these two light tanks over here. They have a four count in the east side of the map, plus two arty, so we know where all the tanks are. Um, there's nothing on this side of the map except the scouts, so... The closest threat to us, other than the lights, is the, uh, Panther. It's really hard to... Oh, hello, ELC. Should be able to duel him okay. Especially if he misses like that. And he missed again, so easy kill there. And the panther moved over to the east to help. Okay, so we need to defend here um, and not go for enemy arty. Um, the enemy tanks are closer to our spawn than we are to their spawn, um, so we need to defend here. And hopefully our arty will start running away. I'm gonna sit here and try to give some vision for my T-43, who's behind me on the four line. There we go. And there's the panther moving across. It's really hard to lead shots in the chaffee. But we got him tracked. Shell velocity is really low. Not quite as bad as a derp gun, but it's pretty close. You can see how the shells are arcing there at long range. Once again, let's place some vision roll here for our T-43. We need to kill this panther quickly so um, their arty doesn't kill me or the T-43. I got spotted, so let's move up here. Use this rock to stay in cover. Gonna pretend like I went to one bush. I think that just saved my life. I heard an arty shell land right behind me. Got him tracked. Nice. Fortunately, I only have one normal round left and the rest APCR. So that'll be a little bit overkill for arty, but... I carry a lot of premium in this tank because it needs it. Um, with the matchmaking it gets, you just have a really hard time penning 
certain tanks even when you get their sides in this thing with normal ammo. So let's try and spot Artie. And them running towards us is going to make this a lot easier. This is risky that M41 could be aiming for me. Then let's zig a little bit here, make it harder for him to hit. He's either to my right or an A1. There's two bulls back here that already sit in. And there he is. He's not looking the right way. I should have him here before he turns and shoots. Nice. GG, guys. Alright, Sand River, tier 7 game, um, one Artie, one Scout, they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven fast tanks, so half their team, um, we're a little bit slower on our team, well, we're about the same. Pretty sure I'm gonna play in the middle here, in the 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 ramp in G5. It's an important spot on the map to try and control, um, and since I'm so high tier, I can stand my ground a little bit. And we'll pull up this ramp here and do a little peek and see what the enemy is sending where here in the middle of the map. Oh, MT-25 is doing a roll scout. And that E-25 is changing my plans. I gotta... If he's going ham like this, I need to deal with him. Fortunately, I missed my scouting opportunity. But I need to help kill this guy. <laughs> nice ram, Skoda. How to throw away two perfectly good E25s, guys, right here. Oh, Hellcat paid for peeking. Enemies are being really aggressive but not in the right spots. So that IS died from some good sniper fire. I'm gonna pull up to this rock right here and see what this panther lights. You can usually shoot into this corner where this um, Japanese tiger is without getting spotted, uh, especially from this range. Nice, he's down. Skoda wants me to help him, I think I'm gonna work on this KV-3. Need premium to pen the side of his turret like there, from that angle. Okay, he's backing off, so let's reload normal. And now that we're up by a lot, let's, let's go for the... Let's go for the jugular here and go for the, um... Just push for our advantage here. Oh, there's a jumbo here late to the fight. And he didn't spot me. 
That's how important crew skills and equipment are, guys. I was only about 230 meters away from him. This KV-3 is by himself. I want to. I think I'll solo him here. Let's go for it. I want a good fight here. Let's go for the track. Let's start circling him here. T-37 is kind of a sluggish scout, but I should have enough to keep traversing him here. Let's go for another track shot right here. There we go. Poor guy. Nice. That was fun. I always like trying to solo heavies and scouts. We got some long range shots on the SM6. So unfortunately we didn't uh, have a large spotting role for our team, but um, doing direct damage through our positioning is also very useful when you're playing scout tank. Just do whatever you need to do to help your team win the game. So whether that's spotting or doing your own damage or a combination. I think I'm gonna try and ramp kill this guy, get a kamikaze. Let's shoot him once and then ram. Ah! <laughs> I might die here. He's gonna turn and shoot at me. Let's see if we can drive forward and dodge. Nice. And I think I'll get him before he reloads. Nice. GG boys.